the end of that first Atlanta game, did you kind of, I think you even used the expression live and learn. Yeah, it's, I was conservative there. Um, I thought we could we could grind it out. I was hoping we could do like we did last night and get the first down by running it. Unfortunately, we didn't. Uh, we lined up to kick, and, you know, I didn't expect the outcome to be what it was. But I also learned that, you know, in certain situations, circumstances, sometimes it's better to do what we did. Uh, we've been in that situation the last couple of weeks, and 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 we decided that hey, we're going to keep you know keep our, our our game plan intact, continue to do the things that that um, aren't expected, and I think that's kind of what's happened as well. I think Mike's made some really good decisions, and um, I'm real pleased with the outcome. I mean, obviously, if, again, it goes back to that whole point I said after the Atlanta game. If we had made the kick, it'd have been a moot point. Well, it was a kick in the gut. It really was, more so than anything else. Um, but you can turn around and say that this year's Saints game in New Orleans was, was might have been the, uh, the, 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 the spark we needed. So, again, we're in the position that um, you know I think everybody's excited about. I think it's the position we'd hope to be in, um, considering the start, the way things in, you know, through the middle of the season was, uh, you know, was for us. So this is uh, this exciting time. Uh, did your gut say you guys could recover from that and be in this position? Oh yeah, I always believe me. I, I always said it, and and we're in it. And 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 again, I'm making no apologies for being in it, guys. We're going to line up and play on Sunday, and we'll go from there.